I made this video of a sculpture called Warped in late May of 2013, just before packing it up to move it and my other sculptures into storage. The building in Williamsburg, Brooklyn, where my studio was located for 26 years, had been sold and the new owner was converting it into living spaces. This is a sculpture from 2009. I have had a long time fascination with folding screens. They are a bridge between art and the functional Renaissance. Sometimes traditional Japanese and Chinese screens have painted images of people, flowing water, birds, or other animals that seem to be gazing at or about to flow or fly through the real space between the panels when the screens are in a typical zigzag position. This prompted me to build a folding screens that have actual elements that violate the form in a way similar to the way pop-up books were except I wanted the elements in my screens to have a more robust physicality and to pass through the panels. This is the third and largest screen that I built. Because of the size and lack of cross beam support, it warped when I constructed the first panel. It is really more rickety than the smaller folding sculptures. I was upset at first, but then I saw the elegance and the way the torqued surface caught the light. So I went ahead and built two more panels, which obligingly, also warped. To my delight, they folded it together more or less like a flat folding screen does when I attach the hinges. Well, my method is to build the screen first, then cut into the panels and insert the renegade on it. When I built the first screen in the series, I expected the inserted form to get crumpled, like a crashed car. When I folded up the screen for the first time, instead, it curled up inside and re-emerged intact showing great resilience.